new seven figure product that you can drop ship right now. The best part is it follows all three of our recommendations. I've had stores that have done six figures and I've had stores that have done seven figures. And I can tell you now, if you wanna to scale to seven figures with an e-com brand, you need all three of these things. The first, lightweight and small. And the reason is, number one, manufacturing costs are cheaper later on when we wanna get it in bulk. If something's small, it's usually cheaper to manufacture, the exception being like diamonds or something like that, for example. Um, as well as that, it's usually a lot cheaper to ship if items are smaller because packaging is either packaging size is big, which costs us money, or the weight of a product costs us more money. The second is dropshipping is very saturated, guys, in today's world. If you want to make money, you need something that has a high perceived value. You need something that has big margins, basically. If you take a product for $15 and you try and sell it for $22 and then you factor in your ads, you're just never gonna be able to hit seven figures. Or if you do, you know, your margins are gonna be so slim. You've put in all this work to finally get a winning product. You may make like 10 grand. It's really just not worth it. And then number three, and this is personally one of my favorite things is, I look for products that have no to limited variants. When you have things like sneakers, shoes, you know, clothing, there are a lot of returns for sizing problems. You have to order in when it becomes later on, you want to store in a 3PL, you have to order in in bulk and then you have all different sizings to, to worry about and different colors and different things to manage. It's a lot of work. I look for something that usually has just one or two variants max, dif no difference in sizing. So this is an absolute baller product I'm about to give you. This is a seven figure product. And this is right here, a little, um, a little brooch or however the fuck you say it. It's like a blazer pin, okay? And it's a pin that just goes on your blazer, but it looks designer. It has that Gucci look. It has that Gucci feel. And you see here, there's already 2,000 of them sold. Where a lot of people go wrong, I'm gonna tell you right now, if you wanna drop ship this, they take this product, they also take this, this, and this, and they just copy all of those things across and then they add some copy paste ridiculous name. You are never going to sell. It does not have a designer appeal to it. I would take just this product only. Forget the others, just take this, and I would call it like ALT Designer Lux Pin or something like that. ALT Designer B Pin. And if you're not creative, you can ask ChatGPT to do this for you. You essentially are gonna take this product, I would order it in. You can probably find this on Amazon as well and Amazon Prime yourself one very quickly. I would take a whole heap of custom footage and I'll put that on the website and that is how I would market that product. I would have that individual product with my own photography, own videos, get a heap of UGC made. You can get it created very, very easily just with friends and I would have it look extremely luxury and I would charge, the price point I would charge for this would be around $80. And you're probably gonna think that's crazy, a $2 pin for $80. Trust me, if you wanna make money, factoring in ad costs, everything else, good margins, and you're here to make money, I would sell something like this for $80. Sometimes I would even up it if the quality's good and I check the quality myself and it's good enough, if it's a heavy metal, I would charge $160, $300. Remember, the only thing that contributes to pricing is value and branding. And again, then our recommended products down here, I would definitely add this as another product on the store, as a pin, I would charge again maybe $90 up to $300 and the exact same thing. You could just develop a whole store to do with um, B blazer pins and make it look like your brand. That's an absolute baller product idea you could test to make seven figures. Let me know if you have any ideas of anything else down in the comments. See you in the next video.